Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In the name of Allah, the most gracious, most merciful. May Allah's peace and blessings be in Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. The respected viewers, brothers and sisters in Islam, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is Amr Dabur. We will be inshallah ta'ala talking today very briefly about rahmah, mercy. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala show us mercy. Ameen ya rabbal alameen. Multiple names of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will be um, around the meaning of Ar-Rahma, around the meaning of mercy, Ar-Rahman, Ar-Rahim, the merciful, the most merciful, the compassionate, is all about uh, Ar-Rahma. So he is Ar-Rahim, the most merciful, subhanahu wa ta'ala. When he created mercy, as we are told in the hadith, he divided it into a hundred pieces. And he kept for him, subhanahu wa ta'ala, 99 pieces, and he sent down on earth, just one piece, believe it or not. One piece of mercy is sent down um, to earth. And in this very piece of, mirth, of mercy, um, all the, the, the humans and animals share. Everybody share in this one piece of um, mercy. In the hadith, even uh, like um, a horse would raise um, um, its, uh, its hoof from the calf, from its calf, um, so it will not hurt. Uh, him. So, subhanAllah, that's, that's the mercy, the one piece of mercy that all of us share. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the most merciful. He has 99 pieces of that mercy. He said, وَرَحْمَتِي وَسِعَتْ كُلَّ شَيْءٍ My mercy encompasses and includes everything. He is Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim, most compassionate, most merciful, subhanahu wa ta'ala. So, if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the most merciful and He is showing us mercy in everything that He is doing to us, why don't we be merciful to others? We are even commanded by our religion, by our Prophet, by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to be merciful. Irhamu man fil ard. Be merciful. Show mercy to those who are on earth, to everything on earth. To believers, non-believers, animals, uh, environment. Show mercy. Show mercy to others. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will, will show you mercy. Ar-Rahimuna yarhamuhum ar-Rahman. Those who show mercy, the compassionate, the merciful, Allah will show them mercy. Have mercy or show mercy to those who are on earth. So... Uh, uh, the one in the heaven, the one in the heaven, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will show you uh, mercy. Let's be merciful. Let's deal with mercy. Let's tolerate others. That's part of mercy. Let's be, uh, quote, and, and, and behave like part of that rahmah of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that He um, um, is showing to everybody around us. You know, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala appreciate if we are merciful, appreciate the mercy from uh, our part. As we are told in one hadith, the very beautiful hadith that um, um, of a man who was walking in the desert and he was very thirsty, about to die, out of thirst. And then he found the well and he found the water and he was, you know, he drank and, 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 and as he was walking, uh, coming out of the well, he saw a, a dog, very thirsty dog. Uh, he said, subhanAllah, that's, that's the same state that I was in a few minutes back. And out of his mercy, he came down. Uh, in the well, and he found nothing to take water to the dog but his shoes. And he um, uh, got water for this dog uh, in his shoes, and he found not, he couldn't, he couldn't, you know, in his way out, he couldn't um, uh, handle it but, but to put the shoes in his mouth. And he came out and he gave water to the dog. In the hadith, فَشَكَرَ اللَّهُ لَهُ فَغَفَرَ لَهُ Allah appreciate that action, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgive all of his sins. You might have all of your sins. Uh, being forgiven if you are merciful to others. Show others mercy so that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will show you mercy. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us merciful and show us mercy. Ameen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.